啦。Hello, peeps, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome back to Plywood Studios. That's going all right.、Um, still working through some of the backlog of cues from all the aggressive training that we did,、um, and you can see here as well the mega scan is closed because I wanted to get that upgrade done as quickly as possible.、Um, so yeah, still sort of processing through that backlog, and they're starting to get through to treatment in some areas.、Um, so got all that going on. You can see here that we have、uh, we're definitely curing our stunt trouble、uh, patients, which means that these two are ticking up nicely together.、Um, <coughs> two birds, one stone. We like that.、Um, okay. Now I'm ready to build a research room. Probably a bit pointless, uh, uh, but you know what? Why don't we? Let's do it all the same. We've got the money. We've got the time.、Uh, so research, research. Okay. Now,、um, do you know what? I will just have it like this. We will. And you know what? We will stick this. In this corner, yes,、yeah, so、it's a fairly small、uh, research. We're going to do. I like to do this corner of screens, so we're going to try and squeeze that in this very small research room. Right, <laughs> very very pokey. We can put the this board here. Look behind there. And what I like to do with the whiteboard is stick a chair there. You know, like they sit there and they. They、look at the problems on the board. Take time to try and work them out. Occasionally, standing up and、uh, <coughs> fretting over equations and whatnot. So we've got that going on. Let's give them、uh, the snack stuff、uh, so that the researcher who we have employed can eat and whatnot.、Uh, always good. Always good. I think this looks a bit researchy. What does this actually? This has. Diagnostic power <laughs> doesn't really help with the research. I suppose I could, but this also looks cool in the research room. But it's diagnostic. Do you know what I mean? It's a bit of a shame because it kind of looks apart in here.、Um, oh, isn't there also that desk kicking? Oh yes. Oh yeah. Gotta love. I, I love this desk. Absolutely love this desk.、Um, it's getting proper porky in here, isn't it? Maybe if we. Maybe we'll need to do that. Oh God, yes! Look at it. Okay, <laughs> I'm excited. Okay,、um, <clears throat> and then of course we do have those superbug items, which if、um, you're new to the game, and you might be, because there's been big sales going on and whatnot, and I'm aware that we've got some new players.、Um, but if you've missed a bunch of the superbug items, I can't find it now. Um, you can get a bunch of them、uh, if you go to the Two Point Hospital website and、uh, sign up to their hospital pass. <coughs> you have to link it to your Steam account,、uh, which is which is fine because then you can download some of the superbug items. Not that this is a superbug item, but you know、um, <coughs> the pipette was、uh, that we saw、um, and. Uh, also, actually, in the mega scan, I've got a. Where am I? I'm lost in my own hospital. In the mega scan, was, was that superbike item? Do you know? I can't remember.、Uh, But I do have a bunch. I'm Harrison Wolf, and welcome to Two Point. We're gonna stick that in there. But yeah, you can get the, the items from the first three superbugs. Um, from there, like I know the nice smelling sanitizer, which I've started actually to put around the hospital. You will be pleased to know. Oh my goodness, what am I doing? It's level three, good. Right, so we're going to do that. Uh oh, no, I've done something to the. There we go. So there we are. There's that. <clears throat> Now it'll be very hot in this room, especially because we've also put that in. So it's a hot level, and we've stuck that in. Look at it. This might be one of those occasions where that duck might come in use. Oh my god, it's not in temperature, even though it does. It must be under decorative. Can I find it in duck? No.、It、must be in decorative, but it does work. What is it called? Frozen art. 
but it gets it's so cold don't really have the room for it now that's the only problem straight up don't have the room for it <laughs> uh -ohs. oh it's an invalid room right that took me ages to work that out right okay um fine well we won't be doing that then so uh yeah it, it helps when you uh read things on the screen of course i've been playing for a while now i'm just getting a little bit cross-eyed uh so we need clearly having trouble look i can't i can't do anything i can't do anything i'm getting tired look uh right can we fit this in so, look can we fit no oh my god can we fit, can we fit that? Uh, okay. Can we get no? Can we stick it in front? Oh yeah. Oh no. Wait, whoa. <laughs> Did I need access to that? Since when? Okay, let's stick one there. Okay, look. Do you know what that will do? Oh my god. There's something causing a problem with deep thing one. <laughs> it's fine, I fixed it, I fixed it. What have we got here? Right. Um, there it is and you can see actually that research has been slowly progressing because of course anybody who dies from stunt trouble and becomes a ghost and then when they get sucked up with the vacuum cleaner that uh, goes towards research also <clears throat> uh, if I was to put like in this room for example if it was a higher level um, I could put the computer uh, and this in it which also has research power and it means that anybody you diagnose in that room with that particular illness would also uh, contribute towards the research of this sort of stuff. So that's how we've managed to get some and how I've been progressing so far in all of this without actually <laughs> researching it, which is amazing. So we're going to do that. There we are. We're going to do that. We've got the researcher. So we're going to do it. Oh, sorry. Potentially a waste of time at this point, but there we are. Uh, let's just do uh Hopefully they'll be able to catch up. Of course, so many queues. It's no joke. So many queues. The fratch ward's not really big enough either, by the way. Um, <laughs> could try not to worry about it. Try not to worry about it. But you can see here that things are going a little smoother um, through diagnostics. To show you what's going on with the staff here see that the GPs are looking a little bit a little bit better what we'll do we'll actually take this GP um, we'll actually pay for the training because we can afford it let's have a look here now Marnie where do you work Marnie oh you're a treatment nurse let's change your outfit okay and we will train you in treatment too um, right the pharmacist is very busy so we're going to actually Ooh, we could do that though so we'll do that we've got all the money so um oh the marketing the marketing now how is yeah so i think what we'll do we won't train him i was thinking about training him but i think what we need to do is get another marketing campaign on for stunt trouble um now where is where is he gone he's going he's going for a break no you're not no you're not sunshine right in you go good train a staff member that'll be great i did actually get a five uh, a show rating of five out of five um between the uh, uh between episodes um which is really really great because i was employing a bunch of janitors employed a bunch of janitors and um <clears throat> it, it said it was enjoying all the new characters um so that's so that's great oh look look it's surgery starting to build up. <laughs> it's all starting to build up. Um, as they process all those people. Because while I was aggressively training, you know, all the GPs and all the diagnostic nurses, of course, the queues are building up. They have massive queues, but now the queues are sort of moving through to treatment. <laughs> of course, in queues. Try not to worry about it try not to worry about it um janitors then so mickey here could do with maintenance training too uh, so we're going to do that 
maintenance training too. There's not a lot of maintenance stuff around here, so we're going to pay for it. Um, we'll check out Delilah. Um, let's see here. Delilah. What? Yeah, so we're actually going to swap Delilah over. And we could do... Grumpy. There's nothing like a burp. I guess we'll do this. Now, we, what we want is we would like somebody to like water fixed. the plants and clear up a bit. Open your mouth and have a burp. You know, that's what we need. Hours a day. That would be great. Now we can do more diagnostic training, which I'm kind of up for. Um, but it's going to go. We've got cues, but we're going to. I guess we're going to have to create more cues. So we're going to put two of them into training. So we're going to start the queues again. It's terrible. But what we can do maybe is clear some of this out. You shouldn't be here. Um, you need to come out the toilet. I love these toilets. They're so lovely. They're just so lovely. Come out of there. Come out of there, Osman. Nice to see he washed and dried his hands though. Please about this. There we go. Lots of deaths. Cues. The cue knock on effect, eh? Not the best. It's not been the best. Um, oh, and of course I built a new GP office as well. But if, you know, if you put them through GPs too quickly, again, that can cause cues and problems. Um, in treatments, you know, just certain bottlenecks, okay. You don't want to go too nuts, so you want to be able to diagnose everybody before, diagnose and treat everybody before they die of depleted health, right? We'll try and cure 10. I can't see that being an issue. We should be able to do that. How's it going over here? Okay. Just keep working on that. I was thinking a second, um pharmacy nurse might be good um so that when one's on break it doesn't stop and it was similar with the um i was thinking with the uh mega scan you know maybe a second doctor doing that might not be a terrible idea um yeah might not be interesting okay but the mega scan it's all right though isn't it the mega scan is okay good 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 we could upgrade something couldn't we i don't really want to upgrade this because of the queue on it at the moment but maybe we could arrange to upgrade these bits and bobs as we've got the money to spend it but what have we got in templates i'm not sure if I have, oh look, I do have a basic deluxe clinic. Let's stick it in. Yeah, okay. Do I have a clown clinic one? What's wrong with that? Oh, did that say it contained too much stuff? What's that say? Template contains one or more locked items. Oh, okay. Interesting. <laughs> What's it mean by locked? <gasps> There's a fire? There's a fire? Oh my goodness. Okay, quick, let's just close that a minute. Let's grab the fire extinguisher because I'm going to want them to not just put out the fire but also repair the piece of equipment. Uh, and sometimes if you leave it open, it just continuously gets used. Um, so we've put in the deluxe clinic, um, but another thing that Roderick could be getting on with, oh, we don't have it, we could do Pan's lab, couldn't we? Should we do that? Shall we do a Pan's lab here? I think we will, because there's also deluxe clinic, uh, deluxe clinic, we've already said that, um, there's also uh, shock therapy patients coming in, I noticed. Um, am I still on templates? I am. Turn, turn those off treatment it's nice to know i didn't think i could filter through templates but i can look at that oh my goodness it's so good they thought of everything right 
Um, yeah, there's we got shot client coming in and head office. It, there's plenty we could be doing here, but let's for now get this going. Oh, I've I've done the shot clinic one. Oh my goodness! Actually, on that, should we just go to treatment cost a minute? What would benefit us the most? Shot clinic and head office. <gasps> oh. Okay, right. So what we are going to do is the shock clinic and the head office. So we'll put shock clinic here. Okay. Um, throw that in there a minute. Let's pull this out. Stick that by the door. Right. So what we want is um, like a level three shock clinic. Okay, so here it is. I've decided to go straight for level five. Um, just because I tend to not put clinics in until, you know, the hospital's really quite stable. Uh, so we've got two of these researching devices in here as well. And these are 30 grand each. So this is actually a really expensive room. <laughs> uh, so maybe, but it does make it level five. So what am I, I don't know. It's like, yeah, no, I will leave them in this. What we'll do. I'm going to make this the uh, the shock clinic um, advanced, right? Okay. Then what I'll probably do is take these out, uh, which makes it still level four, right? But it's a hell of a lot cheaper. Um, so I might make this the shock uh, clinic basic. So it's 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 higher than level three, but it's it's just a cheaper version. Um, should I not ha have that kind of money for whatever reason? It does also make the room quite hot. And of course, we're already on hot level. Look, it's made absolutely no impact that. So what we might do is take them out. That's interesting. Yeah. Ho, 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 ho. So we might, as that is still level five. Um, mind you, if I took those out and stuck that in, that would probably prevent it from being level five. No, it's still level five. Okay. An aircon unit right above them. Ooh. Okay. It's tricky. So might have to look at redoing it so that there's some built-in cooling because uh, it is crazy in there. Uh, and you, this uh, wall air unit doesn't need maintenance. Um, forget which DLC that comes with now. Um, I'm pretty sure it's one of the DLCs. Uh, it could be Close Encounters. Not sure. uh, anyway, there we are. That's that's that room all sorted. So the next room we decided to do was the head office. Yes, uh, another room for Roderick to be dealing with. And all of these, what was it? It was like ten grand a pop, right? I mean, that's absolutely amazing. And there's the head office. Excellent, excellent. So that should keep uh, Roderick nice and busy. Uh, and we definitely still need plenty of stunt trouble to come in. In fact, Roderick might actually start needing some help. Uh, that might actually be a little bit too much work. Uh, let's get some more Bennies in. I think that's worth doing. There we go. Let's uh, also get some delightful pictures. Uh, behind them as well. Lovely. Do you know what? We'll take that one and pop it there as well. Excellent. Good. You're going on break, are you? What a nightmare. What an absolute nightmare. What do we have in the way of treatment doctors? Nobody really. I mean, grumpy. Guess, Peggy. Uh, what we could do uh, with you. Um, is pop them we didn't do pans lab in the end but there we are um, but keep them out of stunt trouble just so that roderick has plenty of work to do in there we have another fracture emergency but honestly uh i'm not sure it's a good idea because uh, we don't really have enough beds for six we'll give it a go but it might blow up in our face not gonna lie not gonna lie oh my goodness this is this is crazy isn't it all the time all the time. I think the queue has gone down a little bit, 
but not much. Uh, and also we could probably do with more surgery. But I'm not going to worry about it because we are creeping towards the third star quite nicely. So I'm really not going to worry about it at all. Um, it's, I, I just, you know, it really doesn't matter at this point. We just need to, I'm not doing that. <laughs> we just need to um, let Roderick uh, keep curing these stunt troubles, uh, really. Uh, and at the moment, right, he looks like he was going for a break. But he's, look, he's going to go back and work in the danger zone. <laughs> the danger zone? <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's all gone rubbish again down here. <laughs> it's fine. That's probably... No, we are still okay. Good. Ah, oh, yes. So, um, Squeeze in the comments sort of said, you know, that maybe these should be made out of plywood, given that we're at Plywood Studios. Should these be cardboard cutouts or should these be plywood flames? You know? Then they could paint in it, you know? There's plywood because of the studios. Yes. <laughs> okay, anyway, uh, what am I talking about? <laughs> don't know. Don't know. Uh, we just need to allow Roderick to continue uh, to treat our stunt trouble, lads. Don't we, Roderick? Yeah. Roderick packed episode. We love you, Roderick. Yes, we do. Oh, do you know what? Roderick right now is demanding more pay for everybody. There we go. <laughs> uh, and a 1% bonus for everyone. There we go. Lovely. 1% pay rise. Not bonus, is it? 1% pay rise. Okay. Are you going to drink that? Or are you just going to keep staring at it? It's stuck in some sort of crazy loop. There are people queuing for this. Here we go. <laughs> go on then. <laughs> We're up for it. We want to we wanna see this. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> That's it, Roderick. Got it going on. <laughs> woo, woo, woo. Look, the queue's getting quite large now as well. Yeah! <laughs> it's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. And we've got plenty in the queue to keep him busy. Oh, yeah. Well, things seem to be going quite well. Look at these numbers. Roderick's just gone on break. We are repairing this. We've got plenty of them in the queue. <laughs> loads of them in the queue look at our reputation uh, it's going well it's going well i refuse to explode a machine however what is going on in the rest of the hostel it's not too bad is it um it's not too bad it's okay um i mean there are certainly things that we could do to improve the hostel but given that we're going to be leaving soon i'm not going to worry about it um just not going to worry about it uh, this queue is going down slightly but not by much um you know not by much Right, Roderick, how are you dealing with your break? Pretty good. Get back in here. Here we go. So we can see. Oh, yeah. One more. This person here. And Roderick should get his 20. And we've got enough people in the queue to get this kill 25 patients in stunt trouble. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Yes. Do it, Roderick. Such a superstar. Look at him. <laughs> I like that he watches them. He absolutely watches them all the way. Don't you, Roderick? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. <laughs> Roderick. We love you, Roderick. Pillaging, please. No pillaging, please. This is his certificate, just to let you know that Roderick uh, did watch every episode of ER before he came to the hospital uh, to film backwards. Yeah, never did. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> the annual, uh, the monthly money came in, <laughs> made the game stick. Oh my god, such a champ. I like the way he has to turn it off. Turns it on, turns it off. He knows how to use all the controls. He knows how to use the joystick, the on button, the off button. What does he do with that? Don't know what that bit does. Do you have to insert coins to make it work? <laughs> what's the, what's the... He's different over here. Does he have to insert a coin or something? <laughs> Just to make it work? 
<laughs> on the console. This console's different. Let's see. Oh, he does! That is amazing! <laughs> Oh my goodness, it's like, it's like the car ride! An arcade machine, isn't it? Oh my god, I'm lost in my own hostel again. Don't you just love it when that happens? Look! It, just like here! Oh look, there's somebody on it. That is amazing! That is amazing! I was thinking, I don't normally see a coin slot on those consoles, I'm sure of it! No, we don't! <laughs> oh my goodness! That is amazing! Oh my god! <laughs> anyway, while having fun with this, he even takes the coin out of his pocket to do it. It's amazing. We've got three more to go. <laughs> look, look. He'll... There it is. Oh! <laughs> it's got the noise and everything. Oh. I hope we keep Roderick supplied well with uh, rolls of coins. <laughs> Oh my god. It's amazing. <laughs> it's absolutely amazing. Oh, I absolutely love it. I can't believe. I, can't, I cannot believe how awesome it is. <laughs> Guys. Guys. <laughs> ba 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 ba. Ba da ba. Ba da ba. Just standing around, please. Get on the bike! Let me insert coin! <laughs> and then the joysticks make the bike go backwards and forwards, I reckon? I reckon. Ooh, and to turn it around, apparently. <laughs> and off. Oh my god. Sean Cocktail. Sean Cocktail. I'm not sure I understand this announcement or what's happening, but I can <laughs> hardly contain my excitement all the same. Oh my goodness, it's one more, it's one more, peeps, and then we've done it. It's three stars. It's a three star moment. <laughs> one more coin, Roderick. Uh, let's get rid of that. Sit. Oh, <laughs> Good. Yes. Here we go. Who is this? This is Tony Pebble. Get in, Tony. Oh, I'm so pleased. <gasps> Golden statuette. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Congratulations. Your hospital has been awarded a three star rating by the Two Point Health Ministry. Always leave them wanting more. Is that an adage you're familiar with? Alas, you've exhausted the entire library of tropes and now there's nowhere left to go with your show. <laughs> You've milked the cash cow dry and it's not mooing anymore. But what do I know? I'm just the health minister, yours frequently, Darkwind Foxbridge. Right, okay, fantastic. Well, we have to have, well, it's an item, really. Um, do we have to unlock it? We need to look at some of these items. Look at the throne. Okay. <gasps> Golden statuette, highly esteemed and recently misplaced. <laughs> Did we steal this? Did we steal this? Right, this needs to be. This is what we need. Here, look. Sh sorry, Cheesy Gubbins. Cheesy Gubbins, actually. Could have I love the prominence of this bin. <laughs> nah, nah. Okay, well, we could put... I took the fountain away from here because it, it was a bit in the way. So, But you know what? That, that'll go nicely there. And then, oh, we found drawers again. Let's come over here. Yes. Oh. I kind of like it on the diagonal. It takes up more room, but oh. There's. There's. Oh, people can go and admire it, I guess, so we can't. Okay, we'll have to do it like this. Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. And you see the layout? That's not planet Earth, I swear. Is that is that two point? And these are this is like where the island with the volcano is and stuff like that. Do you think this is a two point layout? Two point like county and it's the whole globe. 
Oh my goodness. Anyway, uh, so sad when that thing happened. Oh my god. <laughs> right. Well, there we are. There we are, everybody. We've reached three stars um, at Plywood Studios. So there we are, Plywood Studios. Oh, I'm so pleased. It's such a great level. Uh, enjoyed it a lot. I like the theme of it. I'm sad to see the end of Backwards, to be honest. Um, and I'm sad to see the end of Roderick. I'm a big fan of Roderick. Um, and he is now a huge superstar once again. He's, uh, you've, done, you've done such a fab job. And also probably spent quite a lot of money on that console. <laughs> If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Thank you to all my Patreons for their continued support.